Hey everyone, welcome to day 71 of Daily Dose of Piano. Today's dose is a piece by Mark Bowler called Sky Pond. This piece is cool because it uses the sostenuto pedal or the middle pedal. Not all pianos have this pedal and it's really used for special effects. So if I backtrack for a moment, let's talk about the pedal on the right. I'm sure many of you have sat at a piano and pressed the pedal on the right, the damper pedal, and then when you play the keys, everything just continues to vibrate. The strings are vibrating because the dampers have been lifted off of the strings. And then when you let go with your foot, all of the dampers come down and dampen the strings and stop them from vibrating. So that's a pedal that we use all the time in piano. The middle pedal, the sostenuto pedal, is kind of like the damper pedal, but it only puts down or it only lifts up the dampers of the notes that you put down right before you press the pedal. So if I play this chord silently, it doesn't have to be silent, but I'll do it silently, and I put the sostenuto pedal down, it's going to continue to let those keys vibrate. But if I play other notes, they're not vibrating because their dampers are still down. So the sostenuto pedal only holds, only allows the strings to vibrate of the keys that you press right before you press the pedal. So to make a long story short, you'll see at the beginning of this video that I press down some keys silently and then I'm putting down the sostenuto pedal. All right. And then I'm playing these notes, but they're vibrating. And then I'll be playing different notes at the same time. So we get this kind of ringing sound from those notes in the middle where I use the sostenuto pedal, but I can also play other notes and not have them be sustained, or I can use the damper pedal on the right and sustain those notes at the same time and even change the pedal on the right while I'm keeping the pedal on the left. So I hope that wasn't um, too complicated of an explanation. Happy Wednesday, and I'll see you tomorrow.